in the last episode. What the hell is going on? There's no time. I need to figure out how to reverse this if we're going to stop him. Who? This Ruvik guy? Who the hell is he? I'm sorry, I have to find this. He will... We... We're working on a method. It's... Like linking brains together. Are you serious? It's a fucking nightmare. Well, I didn't say it was perfect. Especially not with such a... Unstable host. Great. So your research partner is a psychopath. And we're all inside his head. And so we continue. Greetings and salutations, comrades. And welcome back to the evil within chapter 9. Rhymes with good time. Which is definitely what we're having. We're definitely not annoyed with the mechanics of this game and how useless Michael, a.k.a. Sebastian, is. The Michael in this game. Not Flux Dog Michael. Just to clarify. Um, what are we doing? Oh! Castellanos. Was that someone else's memories? That was a little strange. You were moaning in your sleep. Hey. Have a bad dream? I was dreaming about you. Can I have your glasses? I would like your glasses. They're very cute. I mean, so is you. Wait, I'm not sniffing your butt. Thank you for noticing. I'm gonna go use this key. Left side, top row, fourth one in. It's settled. One, two, three, four. Eh. Oh. That's useful. Really? Can I not upgrade anymore? So why? Why lock that door? Why? Be right back. All right, I'm back. And that mirror doesn't work. Is there a thing here? Memories are vague things indeed. It can be easy at times for memories to be distorted by others. That is why they must be cherished. What is going on with that picture? Mm. Why? Ah! Shit! No! Oh dear God, this place has just changed. You look as if you'd seen a ghost. 
Thanks, lady. Oh. Not cool. Not cool! Still can't get out. Maybe this mirror? Why won't you let me leave? Never more, quote the quoth the raven. No, no, not that way. No. Hi, Ruvik. You know we could be friends if you just give me the chance. I see brain juice bottle. Ba boop and boop and boop. Wow, all that for just five hundred lame. Um, I'll take those, that, whatever, it, and that. All right, let's. Go down this way, which is clearly the way I'm supposed to go. I just don't feel like doing it, you know. Wait, I've seen that house somewhere. Have you? Have you really? I've never been here before, but. Wait, isn't this the house that we started in? How did they get here? Pretty sure this is the house that we... Or the building that we first entered. Hey! No, maybe not. Stop, damn it. Lame! Now what? Chapter 9. The Cruelest Intentions. That's a pretty fancy door! Follow the cable. We just left. Why would I go back in? Probably because I'm going to need to actually... Ooh, ready thingy. Tragic fire kills child. Nanny in Crimson City, February 11, 2012. Despite the KCFD's quick arrival and best efforts, a fast-spreading fire house fire took the lives of a young girl and her babysitter yesterday afternoon in the Park Ridge neighborhood of Crimson City. Lily Castellanos, age five. Oh. And her babysitter, Juanita Flores, 56, were unable to escape the smoke and flames that quickly consumed the single-family home. Lily's parents, both detectives for the KCPD, rushed to the scene but were too late to save their daughter from the flames. The blaze was finally defeated by firefighters after several hours, but the home was completely destroyed. The cause of the fire is under investigation, but initial findings point to faulty electric wiring. I'm sorry, Michael. Honestly, I would probably be just as useless as you are if I went through that. You don't need to beat things, Michael. Relax. I'm gonna go do something over here. Um, boop and boop. Ow. Oh, no, no, no. Get off him. Get away. Oh. Oh, hell no. That'll work. Rubik. Rubik. Rubik, 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 Rubik. Get away. Ow. 
That's not cool. All right, now. Try to do this without startling anyone this time. Um, all right, I see two of them. Shoot. I think the only way I'm going to be able to get around them is to just blow them up. Nope! Run away! Oh! What am I supposed to do with him? Oh, I missed a thing. That's the thing. Mansion dining room note. I finally come to recognize the way. The portal to a new world. The details are all there. I've been right in front of my nose. I'm appalled and incensed that I did not see them sooner. The specific process to break down a human psyche, to obliterate it and give myself free reign is so obvious. And now that I see it, now that what I have to do is in front of me, I feel as if there is nothing else I can do. I can have everything I sought, everything I've lost, but I need resources. Jimenez. That Cretan will finally begin to earn his keep. Okay. That was interesting. So what am I supposed to do with Ruvik? Like, I, I have no idea. I didn't incite Rubik. What do we have here? Interesting. I wonder why Rubik didn't come this time. Did I do right? Crane, what did I just set in motion? Is this what you call your inner sanctum? A research lab in your own? I am most impressed. Why are you back? I didn't give you permission. Come now, we're both men of science. Men of science are dedicated to the pursuit of knowledge. You can show me your experiments. I can show you things. You wouldn't like them. You'd think they're gross. In science, one must do any number of things a layperson may find disgusting. I've done many things others would consider distasteful. You think I'm some kind of a monster? You concern yourself so much with your appearance. But that mind of yours, that's all that matters. That's Leslie! Cello. Oh. Is that Ruvik with him? I'm apparently wrong. Okay. Oh, there's a big jar of green here. Yes. So I still don't know why that that Nope. 
gotta be somewhere to hide. No! Okay. And on that note, I'm gonna end this episode. Comrades, thank you so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying. Leave a like, subscribe if you are. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And as always, I and, and as always. Until next time.